This is the most sophisticated equipment in the world. Yeah, so you can you use your articles. It's not good for anything else, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Tom, no laugh. <laughs> you take six newspapers at the table, rolls them all up. I bet the president might do that with newspapers. <laughs> Well, this has just been exciting. Right. I've been really, really glad I've seen this. <laughs> you got about as many notes as I do. <laughs> Dirty Help. towels right over here. Yeah, here. <coughs> <coughs> 
part of our training program. We've got working on the maximum oxygen output of the wastewater. Even though it's the same ground, that ends up running the same way. Most things are going to be a certain amount of oxygen. I guess this is where we're going to wait. Right here, we're going to be online all the data that are coming from our work. We're going to be updating our work. We need to know Excuse me, sir. So we'll accept it. He's already done one. And just put your hand in control. Oh, there you go. Ready, Mike? Go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, next. Down. There you go. Now, he's so much stronger than you're here. Can you do it again? Ready? Same weight that you pushed out. Yes, well, as much as you can. Just push as hard as you can. We can test both muscles, both the quadriceps and the hamstring muscle. The other thing is, one can look at right and left legs to see if there's a metabolism. And for a weight lift, it's kind of important that he has a lot of leg strength. He has a lot of lifting the bar to put in his leg strength. He's got a lot. That's me, you said. Now, Mr. President, I, I know that you chop wood, and uh, although it's not an Olympic sport, I'm going to introduce you to Dr. Peter Van Nice to meet you, Mr. President. And what, what we're going to do is try out on you. We've got the computer uh, program for you at wood chop. We're going to test your strength up here, just like we're chopping wood. Okay, and then bringing the axe out, bringing it over. We'll be able to tell you how many calories you expended, how much cheesecake you've been eating tonight, and you a certain amount of position. So if you'll turn around and kind of back, back up to this and sell it like a horse. You know you can get the house. Just sit right straight down. That's very good. Okay. Yeah, slide forward a little bit. Okay, if you'll grab the bar and bring it down. When you hear the tone, push up as hard as you can. Push up and pull down. Up and 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 down. More. He'll show you what you did. The height of each one of these bars represents your actual strength, both in the upward movement and in the downward movement here. You exerted approximately 52 pounds of force pushing up and approximately 78 pounds pulling back down. Now what I'll do is on the next screen, I'll plot your average value from this position up through this position here. That's what this is right along here. So starting in the lower position right here, you uh, increased your strength fairly quickly, and as you continued in the upward pattern like this, you held your strength for uh, a fairly good straight portion of time. Pulling down, you were very, very strong. This red line that I plotted on here represents the strength of a well-known Democratic candidate for president. <laughs> so you were exceeded his values. <laughs> Did you get that? <laughs> 
and you're Linda expended Nagui. five calories in that six repetitions. So in a piece of cheesecake, you would have to do something like 600 repetitions of your chopping wood to pay for the 300 calories of your cheesecake. Now, this wouldn't have anything to do with the, the Olympics, but I have to tell you that uh, you know, tonight is the night I'm supposed to be like cheesecake. I'm doing that four-day preparation for the time zone change that the doctor has written about. Okay. Right. Uh, so this is your piece there. <laughs> yeah. okay. All right, very good. Well, you did very well, Mr. President. <laughs> well, our weightlifters would have values perhaps of 150 or 200 pounds on this, and uh, someone in a military press or a bench press like this, some of our athletes like Mike Davis, who you just met, probably could bench press four to 500 pounds. So they're well trained in, in that type of movement. Yeah. But the important thing is you, you had a straight line, you did not fatigue, as I might do. So you're chopping wood, three days up there. Looking very good, Mr. President. That's good. Okay. You just follow me. Thank you. Pull this way. Watch your step. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Miller asked if I'd like to say a few words. I feel at this point if I didn't get them over down here. He was some of the finest athletes in the world. And you're mighty proud of them too. I'm proud of you. By the way, here's the writing thing. <laughs> something which brings all your fellow citizens together. It gives us all the chance to wave the flag. We are with you all the way. God bless all of you. Thank you all very much. 